Hi, I will show you the third resonance effect produced within this three phase transformer. Form here is the transformer. Sorry. Okay, there. As you can see, the transform is formed by three toroidal cores and three coils that are interbound by two cores. Okay. This was connected a la primary motor rotoverter and the capacitors are these four capacitors here. They are two in series and two in parallel. One microfarad. Okay. Transformer. Well, the steps I will do are to shift frequency towards the low band until the third resonance effect starts. Well, I will do. I'm lowering the frequency. I'm beginning to, uh, to listen the the sound. Okay. Go on lowering the frequency. There is the fluorescent effect. Okay. Then I will shift frequency to high band until cutoff frequency. In this way you will find AM effect, only AM effect. But if I go on low uh, going towards high frequency, AM FM effect in fair resonant state will find. AM along, AM FM, okay, I go on to high frequency until the cutoff point. Then I will go down more quickly here and again. I will stop in the FM IM effect here. Okay, this is well. We have to take into account that the cores have to be warm to produce the AM FM ferrosonant effect. What I do to warm cores is to keep in ferrosonant state for some minutes. It will warm very quickly if you go near the cutoff frequency. Another thing I want to show you is how the sound increases when I press cores between each other, for example. Look at this. I don't know if you can hear or listen to the sound, but when I press here, you hear. Okay. Again. Well, I'm going on. I will press. I don't know if you will hear or listen the, the sound, but. I press, I press, okay, press again, okay. This is a way to show you a magnetostrition, magnetostrition compression. There is also a frequency band where the FM AM effect starts and finishes.
and all this seems to be related to temperature and or core pressure. Thanks for watching.